Big Rob Comedy Entertainment. This is comedian John Moses up here in the Bronx. So, so grateful for the opportunity here tonight. And I'll tell you why. It's a humbling experience. I've done big shows. I've done big shows. I've worked with stars. But tonight, I'm up here at the Star 59. Star 590 Billiards in the Bronx Cafe, having the time of my life. Listen, making it to some people and making it to me, we might have different definitions. I feel like I've arrived right now. I'm enjoying my life. I'm living my life. You don't always have to be driving the fanciest cars and having sex with the models and movie stars and having a never-ending line of cocaine to make it. Sometimes... You just need a grungy billiard and $50 in your pocket. <laughs> My name is John Moses. <laughs> My name is John Moses. Big Rob. One day Big Rob is going to make it. One day Big Rob is going to make it. One day Big Rob could make it. And One I, day Big Rob could I make it. I like him because I just met him. <laughs> and I ain't got no problem with white folks out here. Yeah, some, some of my best friends are white folks. <laughs> thank you, OG. Go ahead, bro. This ahead, is OG. Ahead, this is OG. <laughs> John Moses, thank you very much. Ready? All right. How y'all doing, man? We out here in front of Rob's Comedy Showcase Extravaganza, Bronx, New York, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Jay, the sing median. Originally from Newark, New Jersey, by way of Bronx, New York. I'm standing with I'm standing here with the OG Daryl. Hey, how you doing today? You know, you know, I'm from the Bronx. I'm from New York City. I was born and raised in Harlem, but you know, I still come back here to check out things uh, when I'm not on the road. OG, how'd you how'd you like the show tonight? The show was um, it was so so. I mean, you know, you had some fantastic acts up there. I love the singing. Hey, man, you know, you took it down to the road, and you took it down to the groove. I do what I do, ladies and gentlemen. Get your shit together! Brick City, might have seen me in the movie Dirty Game, D-U-R-D-Y, Game, G-A-M-E. Comedy only in the hood, DVD, one hour, 20 minute, feature film comedy in the hood. Three-time Def Comedy Jam alumni, three-time BT Comic View alumni, Cedric the Entertainer, Mike Epps. I done been around. I had a few 24s in this game, ladies and gentlemen. Brother man, brother man, brother man. You know, I, I, was, I, I would tell you, you know, you know, you had your act together. You know, you had the audience going with you and whatnot. Um, I don't know much about comedy, but I just know about what I know about New York City. You know, New York City is a strong city, a hard city. You had a hard audience, but you had them rolling, all right? I did what I do, ladies and gentlemen. Five or five thousand, I come to get down. Do what I do. Now you. Break it down. Rob's Comedy Extravaganza. Showcase Extravaganza. Daryl Reese, New York City, born and raised, Harlem Hospital. Harlem? Check Harlem it out. Hospital. Harlem Check Hospital. Check it out. All right. Newark, New Jersey, Harlem Hospital. Ain't nothing else but New York City. You born in Harlem? You're in New York City. New York City. All right. Holla. Two fingers. Check it out. Just talk about that. Just talk about that. Actually, Smokey was the funniest thing. I enjoyed myself tonight. Oh, me too. Also, I enjoyed myself also tonight. Thank you. Hey, on East 150th Street in the Grand Concourse, we're at a lounge bar. We don't know the name of it, but it's a good hole to go in to play pool to get some chicken wings. Now, basically, I came out tonight to have a good time, and people didn't show me any love, so I just left, and I said, I figured like this. If I could have fun on the outside, why go on the inside? Black people are just chilling. Now, this was a good spot to be at tonight. Uh, they call me Sharon, by the way, and um, I'm a comedian upcoming, and I would love to do a show, but I can't hang out with people that don't show me love. So now, basically, I'm getting ready to go home, Call it a night, work on my comedy, do more um, stand up, and do in better places. We had comedy dev jams right now at a lounge bar in the Bronx. We don't know the name of it because it has no name. It's a little raggedy inside, but basically you can sit down in a chair if you don't get stuck. But anyway, we had a good time doing this, and basically I'm feeling it, and I'm enjoying the moment that I had basically did the comedy show, and now it's time for me to call it a night. They call me Sharon, I'm an upcoming comedian. And we're in the Bronx.
Peace. What's going on? This is Chris Clark. Uh, we outside um, uh, the sports bar, Billard, special game room, Billards. I'm, I'm doing a whole shout out. I, I ain't normally supposed to do this. Um, yeah, we just came out the comedy show. It was good and everything. I'm lying. Listen here. This if they could have had this microphone going into the sound, I don't know what the fuck happened. That shit was like motherfuckers is raving, throwing chairs. I could cuss. I could cuss. It's cool to cuss. They were throwing chairs and doing cocaine and midgets was fighting, jump through a hoop of fire. It was crazy. It was anarchy. Um, big shout out to Diamond Videos. You know what I'm saying? Behind you can't see her. She's holding the, uh, the camera and everything. Um, she's the cool. She always show me love. And um, I never told y'all this, but uh, I've been in drug rehab for 27 years. I'm 25 years old. I mean, I was on drugs when I was a baby. That's some real shit. Um, God is good. You know, you know the Lord said, if giveth No, I'm, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Um big shout out to DJ Mario. Um Ain't no they, you know usually they have like a props and your eye be going to the side. I'm just watching crackheads going by. And I really don't know what to say. But um yeah, you can hit me up, uh Facebook me, uh comedian Chris Clark, spell with it yeah, at the N C L A R K E. Twitter me, Chris Clark two oh three. Um Yeah, I'm just trying to get off these drugs. That's it, man. Seems like it's another year and uh, coming across some old tapes here. And uh, just like cassette tapes, who uses this stuff anymore? So what I'm about to do right now, I'm about to go through my old archives, uh, edit some old tapes. You can find them on YouTube under uh, DJ Mario TV. Uh, don't forget, if you'd like to be a subscriber, please do so. And you can find me Monday nights at Mocha Lounge, 2210 Frederick Douglass Boulevard. Tuesday night, Erotic Poetry, same location. And Wednesday night, you can find me at my favorite hotspot, Billy's Black, 271 West 119th Street. Well, that's that with a baseball bat. Don't forget, if you need me for future events, hit me up, 212-587-4979, 212-714-7188, or Diamond Video at 212-300-5665. And don't forget, it's nice to be important, but it's much more important to be nice. Thank you for tuning in to DJ Mario TV. So check this video out. It's coming up right after this. Peace. Coming out and uh, supporting Thursdays at Nabe. I'm Jazzy. You can reach me on Jessica Space Jazzy J A Z Y Space Ransom. I'm on Instagram just to Jazzy. So you know I'm busy out and about New York, Staten Island, the Bronx. I'm all over the place. But I have a few things coming up. First, my first Thursday is coming up. That's uh, Thursday, February 7th, right here at NABE, 127th and 8th Avenue. Would be nice for y'all to come out. I'm going to have a little jazz band called Denzel Rollins and Bands. They're going to be playing just one set because I know you came out to party and network, so I'm not going to keep you long. Then I have another event at um, the Alhambra, which is a pre Valentine's Day with uh, CJ Classic Soul. And uh, we're going to have a nice time there at the Alhambra. And then February 16th, another Saturday, I'm going to be at the uh, Capitol Castle, where we're going to have the 39th house party. And if you have never been, you need to stop by something outside the box. Four floors. And up. Oh, Jazz is going to be your barman, so stop by and get something liquid, some eat, some nice people, and just network for 2019. So add on to what you already have. And I want to again thank people for coming out and supporting each other to pick up new friends, new old friends, again. and just have a nice time. What again, thank Mario and uh, Mario TV Land. Again, thank you. Enjoy oh, the rest baby, of the evening. Bye bye. Go. <laughs> what's up, what's up world? This is your boy Comedian Joe Show out here. Uh, we in the Bronx right now. We at Big Rob's Comedy Entertainment. 
show in the BX is going down. It's a good year for comedy. Bin Laden's been captured. The Knicks is doing their thing. Well, not so much, but the Knicks is back, so it's a good year. A lot of things to talk about, lots going on. You know what I'm saying? We got uh, DJ Mario live right here tonight. You know what I'm saying? We doing our thing and having a great time. So definitely come out and support. And uh, what was the name of the, uh, I hate to do this, but what was the name of the thing again? Diamond T. <laughs> Take it, let's do it again. <laughs> you know what we got? My mother, my mother watches TV at night. And she watches YouTube. Ah! Are you on? Yeah. Get it, Elijah. Oh. Get it, Elijah. Get it. Hey. 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 Watch out, I'm explosive. <laughs> That's it. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm giving you all those jokes, little joy, and that joke, y'all take it home and Yeah, y'all take this joke and go home. You can take this job and chop it all up. Y'all can get a little squeaky. What the fuck was that? He's wrapped up. Yo, Elijah, did you just smack the shit out of Joe's show, man? He's wrapped up. That's what you get when you fuck with a nigga that you don't know about. I just want to let y'all know, it wasn't my fault. You know, I mean, you might have seen footage. I didn't know she was recording. And I've I had one one drink. One, maybe five drinks. But it's still it's still one and they add up. So it's still one. And I didn't know. He he, he had bothered me earlier. Because you can see my size and you see his size. And then when he... Yeah. I'm sorry. Am I supposed to hold this to my mouth? No homo. I'm supposed to be out there and, 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 and doing my stuff on stage, and then he come over here trying to tell me I can't I can't go on stage with a beer. Who are you? You're not even the manager. You're not even the manager. You know you. Fuck off the mic, yo. Yeah, son. See. This is what happened, yo. You want to sneak and punch me in the club? You know what I'm saying? This is what we doing. Get the fuck out of here. Get your ass out of here, yo. This is real stand-up comedy over here. It's not, it's not right. And it's not over, yo. It's not Peace right. out. <laughs> Maybe we we'll have a better, better one, but I enjoy. I enjoy because this is my day, and I thank God for waking me up to see another day. And thank you all for having me out again, and thank for, thanks for having me out again today. And I want to thank Big Rob for having me to come out too. Thank you, and God bless. I'll be coming back again, okay? Thank you for having me. Live from the Bronx, Channel Action News. <laughs> What's up? It's your boy Joe Show right here. Big Rob's comedy show tonight in the BX at the pool hall. We do comedy shows wherever we get down. We have a good time. It's a good year for comedy. Good year for Obama. He's having a successful month. Just caught Obama. I mean, excuse me, just caught Osama, Obama, whatever. It's still wrong. But we just caught Bin Laden. No more terrorist actions. We could, hallelujah, right? We could freaking wear our shoes to the airport and get past, carry water, do whatever we want to do because it's good now. Terrorism is over. We living in a free world now thanks to o Obama. You know what I'm saying? I ain't vote, so I don't even know who the president is. But yeah, this is your boy Joe Show. Being original, keeping it original right here in New York City. Comedian extraordinaire. Look out for me. Look for me on Facebook. Keisha! <laughs> That's how we do it. Diamond Video Entertainment. Joe Show, we out. Hey, what's up, everybody?
This is Rob from Big Rob Comedy Entertainment. Um, I just finished having a show tonight, uh, Wednesday night. Um, Laugh Out Loud Wednesdays right here at the Sports Billards. Um, we had some comedians that came out. They did their thing, you know, and I like to give much love to all the brothers who came out. Brothers like comedian uh, Cool Herm, comedian um, John Moses, comedian Dino, comedian um, Alvin Irvin. Um, there's a few other brothers that came out that I can't recall right now because I'm trying to get this little interview going. But at the same time, this Wednesday was a nice turnout. I want everybody to know that we're doing comedy here every other Wednesday. And if you need to contact me, I can be reached at 917-517-0642. My Facebook is under the, by the name of Robert D's. You can look me up, request me as a friend. You understand? And I can keep you posted with all my current events. From uh, Also, you know, I'm a party promoter, so I can also keep you posted up with the Floss events and then the Big Rob Comedy events. And like I said, my Wednesdays is every other Wednesday. So if you want to come out, you need to give me a call. If you want to get booked for a show, you need to give me a call, 917. 917- 517-0642. You're listening to a big Rob Comedy Entertainment. I like to say love, peace to everybody who came out. I appreciate all the support. Those that continue to come out, please continue to come out. And those that didn't come out, you need to come through. The shows is nice. I always got good comedians. This is Diamond Video Production, signing off. Peace.